if you find yourself in medium wind strength, then um, it's a good time to try something new because that's the point that you're not too overpowered or underpowered. Now in this video we are a little bit windy, but we're still going to do it just for the, the, the idea um, that learning something new is still fine, but it's, it's um, really a lot simpler in, uh, in medium winds when you can focus on the maneuver. And for, for our maneuver, it's a bit racy, but we're going to do mark rounding. So we're going to be going downwind, uh, and we have got the lured mark uh, just on the port side of my bow. Now, first thing you'll notice is to go around that to port, I'm on the wrong jibe. So I'm going to jibe nice and early ahead of the mark. Okay, that's just so we have one less thing to think about when it comes to the rounding itself. The next thing, as we spoke before, controls are a bit different from upwind to downwind. So we're going to have to get them ready for the upwind. So pull the Vang on, pull the Cunningham on, um, outhaul if you need to, so he's ready nice and early. There's an order of importance, but for this, we'll just go with whatever for now. And then we're going to stay nice and wide on the entry, so we can sheet and steer at the same speed, so we can be nice and tight at the exit from the mark. With the boat flat and the control set as well as possible. From this point here, you should have established yourself quite a nice little lane from that rounding. You can reach forward, re-trim any of the controls that you need to. We're in a training dinghy here, the Zest. It'll be a lot easier in a, in a more racing boat, but it's a fabulous boat to, to, to do this stuff in. So there we are. Key points were be on the right jive early, get the controls on nice and early. There's often an, an order of importance on the controls. Um, we just did whatever for them. Go in nice and wide, sheet and steer at the same speed. The windier it is, the faster that will be. Um, and exit nice and tight. If you're not quite comfortable going out on your own when trying these new things, um, do look at the RYA training scheme and find a relevant direction for you. That could be seamanship skills, racing, performance based, the, the whole lot's there.